Hey guys, welcome back. This is episode 2 of our Zelda playthrough. Uh, this is my first time playing the game, and the only tool I'm using to give me a hand is this Nintendo Power map that uh, I've been referencing here and there. So anytime I reference it, I'll throw it up for you guys to see what it is I'm looking at. I just realized that none of the dungeons past Dungeon 4 are actually listed on the map. Everything else is just a question mark. So from here on out, I think there's going to be a lot more exploration and... Uh, some would say that's the best part of a Zelda game, so let's jump right into it, shall we? Here we are, starting off at the spawn area in the overworld, as you always do. So, right off the bat, let's take a look at our map. One of the things I know about this game is there's uh, infamous rock that you have to bomb to get access to something. I'm not sure what this rock gives you access to, whether it's another dungeon, or it's just an area to get a new weapon, or whatever it is, but I see it on the map, it's right here. So how about we go explore in that direction? I have to go uh, basically northeast into the canyons, so let's, let's make our way over there and see what happens. Here we are running by the area for dungeon 1, and now we've made our way as north as we can, so we're going to start going east. Here we are, into the canyon. The belly of the beast, some might say. Probably not many. Oh, I should be able to get a bunch of bombs here. This must be this this must be a bit of a clue for people where all of these enemies have a chance of dropping bombs. Although none of them did. Awesome. Let's take these guys out. I really don't know how to get those flying guys. So I made it to the rock. I know this is the rock, I recognize it from pictures and videos and stuff when I was a kid, but I don't have any bombs. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is start farming the enemies in the last couple rooms. I know blue enemies have a chance of dropping bombs, so we're going to go out of our way to kill as many blue enemies as we can. We'll just have to avoid all of those flying guys. Oh, come on now. Yeah, we'll have to make sure we avoid those flying guys, because that's that's going to be annoying if I lose my flying master sword move that they give you. Here we go, a bunch of blue guys. Someone's got to drop the bomb. No luck. Come on now. Come on now. Lots of money, no bombs. Actually, I think I might eventually just decide to buy a bomb if our luck holds out. I'll just kill all these guys, because why not? Oh, stairs! What a surprise that, that genuinely was, because I had no idea I was going to find anything here. That That's pretty cool. What do we have? Secret is in the tree at the dead end. A tree at the dead end. Okay. There's, there's a lot of things that were actually mentioned, like... Like, uh, references from people, like there was something about walk through, walk through the waterfall. I feel like I'm in a loop here. Okay. So there was definitely someone who told me to walk through a waterfall, and I'm gonna do that now. If I can. Oh, I can! Awesome. Pay me, and I'll talk. I mean, if we're gonna pay her, we're gonna pay her good, and she better tell us something good. Go up, up, the mountain ahead. Go up, up, the mountain ahead. I don't know what that means. Let's try it. Up, up, the mountain ahead. Is this it? No. Unless, maybe it is, actually. Maybe she needs this. Up, up. One. Two. Nothing. Nope, no luck. Let's see what she tells us if we give her ten coins. I know this is getting expensive. This is getting expensive, but it might be worth it. This ain't enough to talk. Okay, well, 
You didn't tell me anything worthwhile the first time. Oh well. Oh well. We're gonna go back around and keep exploring until we can get a bomb. Actually, I'm gonna make my way down to the shop that's near the beginning of the game and see if I can afford bombs. That might be more useful. What do we have here? Oh, bombs are cheap. Bombs are cheap. Arrows are expensive. Actually, I've, I've been able to buy arrows all this time, but I didn't even know. Take this guy out. Alright, so now that we have the bombs, we can keep going on our path to the rock that needs to be bombed. It probably has a real name. I, I have no idea what it is. Clear these guys out. Clear these guys out. Maybe they'll give me, give me a fairy or something to refill my health. see what we get. I'm not sure exactly where, so... Oh no, you gotta be precise. There you go. Let's see what's inside here. Take any one I want. Now is that heart a permanent heart upgrade? And is this potion just... a potion? This looks like a permanent heart upgrade to me. Yes! Yes it is. Awesome. I feel like I made the right choice there. That's cool. I, I was kind of hoping it would be like Dungeon 5, but I uh, I don't mind that at all. A permanent heart upgrade. Okay, so I'm going to take a look at my map again and see where it is we're supposed to go. So I am currently at the bombable rock all the way to the northeast there. I see that there is a question mark just to the southeast of me. I know that there's a bush you need to burn. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go burn some bushes in that area and see what happens. So here it goes. Da -da -da. Luckily this is a short path compared to what we've normally been Oh, dropped a bomb by accident. That sucks. Keep going keep going south. Let's pull this boomerang out for safety. Remember kids, pull your boomerang out for safety. Yeah. I only have one bomb left. Now I think I go north. And north again. This is it. Oh. On the map, I thought those two statues would be bushes. Okay. Hey, more stairs! Let's check out these stairs. It's a secret to everybody. That is that's one of those lines that comes back in all of the all of the Zelda games. It's kinda kinda cool to see where that that stems from. Ooh, 30. Nice. Do I get 30 more? No. Alright. That was a another nice secret. This map is showing me all the secrets. Uh, what else do we have? So, let's pull the map up again, and go explore another question mark. So, if I am here, I can go uh, all the way south. There's a rock formation with a question mark next to it. So, I'm going to explore that and see what we get. Alright, here we go. Down here, I'll go down one more time. I'll start going east, or start going west. I believe we go south at this point. There we are. Now we follow this path, kill these enemies. With these coins, get that part. There we are. And there's a secret here. Something about this. Probably a bomb, or maybe I have to move the rocks. 
Oh, if if I do have to move the rocks, I might not be able to do this secret right now. Might not be able to do that right now. Let's see. Let's see if we can drop a bomb on this rock. No, no luck. Okay, so this is one that we're going to have to put on the back burner. Let's pull the map up again. And we're going to go here. Alright, we found the lake. Let's keep going north. North again. Here we are. Alright. Oh no. Pull out a boomerang. Oh good. Got those bombs that I wasted replaced. Alright, that green rock looks like I either have to bomb it or I can't do this secret yet. I saw that there was a bracelet upgrade at one point that I'm going to get, so unless I can light this green rock on fire, nope. I probably have to get the bracelet before I can do any of this stuff. So back to our trusty map. This time we're going to go into the mountains. So towards the west, there's there's a lot of question marks we haven't even explored yet. There's a cave next to four trees. Maybe that's maybe one of those are the trees that I have to that I have to burn because so that does look like the dead end and it looks like I can follow a path this way to get there. So let's try that. Let's try that. We're going to go all the way to the west of the map and set some trees on fire. Sounds like a good time. Let's go south by two blocks. And we'll start traveling east. One downside about getting more hearts in this game is that it takes longer. It takes longer to get your uh, flying sword upgrade and have full hearts. It's a fair price to pay. Maybe I should swing by the store again and buy some arrows now that I have. Then I have a bit more money, so here we go. Okay, let's cross the river, and I think this is the store we're looking for. Nope, not the right store. Not a store at all. Here we are, let's buy these arrows. Okay, unlimited. Now this is great. This is great. Man, I should have done this earlier. Bears are awesome. Look at that. Clearing rooms. I'm not sure exactly where I am on the map, but I'm gonna stay southeast. Okay, so I'm in the Lost Woods. So I need to go back, and I need to be on the south path here. I took the north path, assuming it would take me to the same place. I had an inkling of a doubt, and it turned out to be right, so... Now we're heading towards that... that dead end. There's a berry for me. Yeah, the bow is, is a huge upgrade. I'm assuming I can... Nope, still can't kill these guys, though. That's alright. So now what I'm gonna do is start setting fire to some trees here. Not that one. And not that one. Apparently we're not supposed to set fire to trees. This game doesn't want to give kids a bad example. Pay me and I'll talk. I don't have money for you, lady. You're the one who's going to tell me how to make it through the Lost Forest, I bet. Okay, well, let's, let's go earn some money with this bad boy. reason I can't use the, the bow and arrow. Did I run out of arrows? 
That's weird. So, I'm back to using my boomerang, because for some reason the game's not letting me use arrows. I think it might be because I run out of them. I hope, I hope I didn't run out of arrows. Oh hey, a fairy. Okay, so, not many enemies are dropping. Not many enemies are dropping coins for me. Although I'm full health all the time. So, that's a thing. Lots of bombs. Lots of hearts. Not a lot of coins. There's some. One. Oh. We'll keep going. Okay, so let's try exploring the most offensive cave in the game. Dungeon number three. Try and get some coins this way. Now, with any luck, these enemies will drop a bunch of them. Oh, yes! That's quite a few coins. Alright, well, I think we found, we found our money spot. Alright, let's see if we can keep farming these first couple rooms here. They're, they're making a killing for me. Fifty! I'm pretty sure that's the number we were looking for. Let's keep this going. Do we get any of these back? We do get these back! There you go. Fifty-four. Yeah, I don't know what that was all about. Uh... I thought I'd run out of arrows, but I don't know, maybe the game was glitched out or something. Correct. 44. Why do I only have 44 coins now? I definitely had more than 50 coins. Oh no. I don't have unlimited arrows. Alright, so... I think I just understood why I'm simul I was simultaneously broke and ran out of arrows at the same time. Each arrow costs one coin. I have to go back into that... Okay, no, I can find seven coins between here and there. There it is. Coin 50. Let's get out of here and not shoot any arrows this time. Boom. Boy, you're rich. You're kidding me. There's... Oh, yeah. You know what I... Go north, west, south, west. To the forest of maize. Great translation, lady. Northwest, southwest. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Boom. 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 Thank you. Alright, so we're here. North. West. South. Hey -o. Now we're talking. Oh, you don't like me. Well, guess what? I don't like you. Oh no. Uh, you've got to be like very close to there. Yeah. Decent. Ho! Oh, this is this is new. Oh my God! These guys have master swords or what? Throwing, throwing blades at me. I wonder if my magic shield blocks that. Is this like the underworld? Oh no! You can't do that here? This is another puzzle. Nope. This whole place is just a big, big maze. I'm down with that. Um, okay, I feel like I feel like we went the right way. Yes. What dungeon's this? Dungeon six. Okay, so we skipped dungeon five, but I know that's okay in this game. 
usually. So let's let's keep going. I'm assuming I won't need anything from Dungeon 5 to beat Dungeon 6, but who knows? I've been wrong before. Oh, oh man. They do insane amounts of damage. of Goma. Goma is the spider boss, I do believe. I remember that from Ocarina of Time. Let's keep going here. We had a key already, luckily. Oh, that's my key. Monsters. I like the blob monsters because they're easy. Hey oh, and they just gave me a compass. So northeast is the boss. Oh man. These rooms are always annoying. I think it's just because I get too stressed out. secret in there. Oh, no, no, no. Like legs are bad. Oh no. You're bad. <sighs> okay, let's take out the boomerang. Oh wow, did I reflect that? Oh crap. Ah no more messing around. We're using the bow and arrow. Let's get through this. Alright, let's keep at it. We're gonna make it through that room. This is the run. This is the run, I can feel it. there. We could definitely make do with more bombs, though. It would not hurt to have more, more bombs. No. Don't want to get hurt. Don't want to get hurt. Awesome. Okay. Let's equip our bombs now and just go ham in the next room with them. Dropping bombs everywhere. Dropping bombs here. Dropping bombs here. Picking up one of these. Gonna drop this bomb. Gonna drop this bomb. Get rid of bombs. I don't think I can use my arrows on these guys. Oh, what? They came back? Awesome. 
were rupees. We did all that for rupees. Five of them. Tell me there is a secret in this room. Yes, awesome, there is a secret. I do not. Now, I wonder if they'll be back in that room. Not that I guess it matters, we don't have to clear them out. They are back, though. surprises for us, because we just can't afford them. And that's not good. That's awesome. Okay. so deep into that, that path. Alright, we're doing pretty good for hearts this run. Alright, there was a dragon I saw earlier that uh, I never ended up beating, so I'm gonna go back up against that dragon. Right here, I think we can take them on. Alright, we got a zigzag, we're gonna make sure we don't get hit. We gotta cut off his heads. Long way around. Here we go. Back at it. Oh, one down. Oh my god, I thought that was gonna hit me. Don't touch this. Oh. oh my god, that hurt. One more, come on. Come on. Just oh awesome. And fairy. That was the best. Any secrets? Okay. Nothing too bad here. Yes, the map. Cool. That's a pretty big, uh, pretty big dungeon. Okay, let's explore. Let's explore down here, so I don't think we can finish this area. Oh, that's what this room is. Okay. I recognize that. There's one room down there I actually haven't finished. What is up here? There's... Looks like we got a magic rod. What does it do, and does it cost coins? No. Is this thing just free? I thought that last time, too. I'm sure it's costing me something. Maybe if I didn't have zero health, I would realize what it costs. Okay, so what can I do with this? Oh. That's alright. That's alright. We made progress by finding that and getting the map, so let's see if we're any better for having it. So this is like a slower arrow, so I have not gone to the right yet, which it seems that that's where the boss is going to be. Ooh, I don't like this room one bit. This room's not so bad.
There was absolutely nothing in that room. Let's try bombs. I know it's on two sides of me. I don't think I can put it into the vault. Heyo! Is the room for the boss? There are secrets where fairies don't live. There are secrets where fairies don't live. So maybe there's a fairy fountain that doesn't have any fairies there? That could be it. those. I don't have enough health to deal with this, but I think if I zig and I zag, I'll be able to take this. Hopefully those two statues in the corners aren't going to also be shooting fire at me, because that'll just be too much for me. How much money do I have? 56. Alright. Zig and zag. Don't forget to zig and zag. So. Whoa! One arrow? All it took was one arrow to take out that boss. Okay then. Also, that heart container did not refill my health. That's kind of a bummer. Bam! Oh my god, that was frustrating. Okay, so they refill your health here. Uh, that was a very frustrating dungeon. Jeez, they ramped up the difficulty for that one. I felt like I was beating my head against a wall for a while there. But, it's really rewarding to be done with it. Okay, the show's over, guys. Thank you so much for watching. There's a couple videos here for you if you need some more. If you want to follow me on Twitter, it's at ReachThatFar. If you want to check me out on Twitch, you can follow me at twitch.tv slash ReachThatFar. Hope you guys had a good time. I know I did. I'll be seeing you guys later. Peace.